Welcome to Life Force Rejuvenation. My name is John. I'm your host. We, this is going to be part of my uh, Quantum Human uh, series. This one is entitled Timeline Jumping. How I uh, picture timelines is just like a rope. You have major timelines that we adhere to. We can pull them apart and have you can do multiple timelines that you know that are just naturally occurring and stuff like that. And of course, you always have your core timeline that's really hard to manipulate because you really got to get down to the finite stuff. But how I know this works is uh, I have this one incident. Um, <laughs> actually, uh, okay, uh, as you know, being an addict in the new program, uh, we have a part that's called amends. We make amends to certain people and they become very entwined in our timeline. Or so we're being stupid with drugs. We pull those out. <laughs> we want to get rid of, get rid of those ones. Whoop, get rid of that part of the timeline, that part of the timeline, because we're breaking old habits and we get a new habits. Um, how I know this works, I have a very interesting story for you. So I did a damage. I did a, a few wrongs and hurt a couple of humans that kind of shattered their soul. <laughs> it shattered my soul too. You got to remember that. Um, but ha how it happened is I made this one amends to my partner, who's my back into my partner, who used to be my wife. And now <laughs> we're back together because I made a thing called it an amends. And what happened is uh, I jumped timeline big time. Because for about a year, I said, I can remember, you know, when did I make an amends and how did I do it and stuff like that? Because I totally forgot because I jumped a major timeline and got onto this new one and I cut it a little too close. Because what happened is, you know, I was asking my partner, I said, well, you know what, how, how did my amends go? And she said, oh, it was so amazing. It was so heartfelt. We were just crying like, like a baby. And But, you know, it's coherent and things were good. And I just blew her away with my amends. I jumped. I cut my timeline a little too close. And when I jumped it, I had no wreck. I mean, I just freaking, boom, jumped these and got onto the, this other timeline. And I have no recollection whatsoever of making this amends, which means to me, I cut my timeline a little short, took out the memory, and I'm here to this day on this particular timeline with you people, explaining that, yes, when we jump timelines, time, jumping timelines can be easy as... Say so you normally pick up a blue pen and you do all your stuff in blue, but instead of doing the blue pen, you start picking up the black pen and doing all your journaling and writing and stuff like that. That's very basic timelines. I had this one uh, human that I was a spiritual advisor of mine. He burned his finger. Now, the easiest time to, to jump lines is the moment that something happens. So all he had to do is go back a little bit and jump on a different timeline to where his finger wasn't burnt. Amazing! <laughs> it could be as simple as that. Or it can be as difficult as like trying to get down to these really hardcore lines. Like this one, which is very deep and ingrained. And you have to go through each and every little tiny line and jump it to get it to come apart Ugh. and be on a different line. Anyway, we're going to go into that on how to manipulate timelines, how to jump, when to jump, where to jump. And it'll be really amazing because it's really true and this stuff really works. Anyway, I'm John of Life Force Rejuvenation. I would like to send you one thing is love and gratitude. Peace around. Mm -hmm.